What's up everyone and welcome to another edition of Firewood for Life and on today's show I'm going to show you how to reinstall a clutch cover on a chainsaw after you take it off and if it won't go back on try this easy solution. It's going to work and it'll save you a trip to the repair store. So a common thing to do with your chainsaw is removing this clutch cover um, whether it be to uh, clean out the inside of the cover or take your chain off or take the bar off. Um, removing it is simple. There's two bar nuts right here and uh, you basically just loosen these up using your tool that came with a saw. Make sure to put these close so you don't lose them. And this will allow you to remove the actual cover from the chainsaw. Um, the basic components are pretty simple. This is your clutch drum, okay? This is obviously the bar, the chain. Um, inside here, you have the chain brake band. And what this band does is when the chain brake, operated by this lever here, when that's engaged, it constricts the band around this drum, preventing the chain from moving. What will happen a lot of times is you can actually remove this cover with your chain brake engaged. And what that'll do is it constricts the band and it prevents you from putting the cover back onto the saw. So what I'm going to do now is I'll simulate engaging the band. And what I did is I engaged that band you can see right here how it's tightened up it's constricted in there so now what will happen is if you go to put this back on it won't fit over the clutch drum it won't fit in there so a lot of people will just assume that something's broken with your saw um, but there's a really easy fix to do you have two options one option if you take a pair of pliers and turn this looks like a propeller um, you can actually disengage this band, allowing it to fit back over. Um, but it's really hard to turn. Actually, you can even take a socket and kind of quarter out some of these um, pieces to make it fit in there and turn it. Um, but the easiest solution is to simply take your cover, take your propeller, line it up right in here with the slots, place it back in. You have to manipulate the handle just a little bit. to get it to fit. Hold this really firm and then pull back on your handle. Just like that. And you can see now that this band is disengaged. See how there's not as much gap between there? And what'll happen now is you can simply slide it right back on. So again, it's a real simple fix, just line up this propeller into these slots right here. Manipulate the handle. That'll disengage that brake band. And you can simply put it right back on. And adjust the chain. Tighten the clutch cover nuts back up. And you're ready to go. All right, there you have it. It's an easy solution, an easy fix to a common problem. Uh, chances are that cover is not broken or damaged. It's just simply uh, the chain brake band that's constricted. Uh, it's engaged and you just need to disengage it. So just line it up, flip that handle back forward and it should disengage that brake band and it'll allow it to slip easily over the clutch. All right, hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget if you like this stuff, make sure you subscribe to the channel, give us a like and stay warm. We'll see you next time.